You might have been too busy scrolling or swiping to sit through the entire Apple's Worldwide Developers Conference, but lucky you, I've got you covered. Here's everything important that Apple announced at WWDC 2025. First things first, Apple announced iOS 26, its biggest design overhaul since iOS 7. The new liquid glass UI inspired by Vision OS features translucent layers, specular highlights and dynamic movement for a more immersive experience. But wait, your phone had 18.5, did they forget counting? No, Apple is now aligning its OS names with the coming calendar years. So say hello to iOS 26, watchOS 26 and so on and so forth. A series of apps get a revamp, including the phone app, which will now have something called call screening to ensure that when you are occupied, the caller reveals their name and purpose for calling. And there's hold assist to make waiting none of your business. Apple also launched a standalone games app to unify game libraries, arcade and multiplayer tools. Now on to AI. Siri got barely two mentions in the whole keynote. I've said Siri more times than Siri makers themselves did, but there were a few solid updates. Their system-wide translation, even on live calls, plus tools for text summarizing, writing help and visual intelligence like Google's Circle to Search. Personalization features also expand across Watch, TV and Apple Music. More importantly, Apple's opening up its on-device models to developers so third-party apps can now use AI online. However, what drew significant attention was iPad OS, finally getting Mac-like multitasking, with resizable app windows, a persistent menu bar, and background tasks shown as live activities. That's a lot to pack in just 90 seconds, though you'd expect more from a 90-minute keynote. With mostly software tweaks and modest AI upgrades, the question is, will Apple succeed in playing the tortoise in a hair race, or is it starting to lose its edge and let the Android catch up? That's all for now. Follow Fortune India to stay tuned.